I pledge allegiance to the Christian flag and to the Savior for whose kingdom it stands. One Savior, crucified, risen and coming again with life and liberty to all. It's just a great feeling when you wake up your kids in the morning and they're excited to go to school. Um, it's spring break or Christmas break or any holiday. They're like, oh, vacation's too long. I miss my teacher. I miss my classmates. I miss school. Some people say that school, like, you just don't want to be at school. But I want to be at school to be here with my friends. I love that he's here. I know that he's safe. He's not being bullied. He's um, just having a great time with his friends, um, like he should be. I feel like once they came here, they really just kind of came alive. And in turn, it brought a lot of joy to our family that I think wasn't there before. Having the Christian education at school, she comes home and she's really excited about the Bible stories that she learns. And at the kitchen table, it's like a conversation piece. The classroom, like, it's fun. Like, you don't feel like you're working. You feel like you're learning and growing spiritually. But it's been neat to see my oldest really grow into a young man and um, the responsibility that he's learned by being in this environment. I think he was the one that needed um, this structure the most. Kids are kids and they're going to grow no matter what environment you put them in. It's just how they grow, I guess, is the difference. So next time God calls you, you say, speak to me, Lord. Can everybody say that? Speak to me, Lord. I am listening. Exactly. What kind of person are they going to be when they leave this school? What kind of person are they going to be when they start college? Are they going to have a foundation where they can stand up for what they believe and stand up for what God says is right? And I think that that foundation has to be set at a young age. One of our big things that we also want is for her to be a good person, for her to be kind and unselfish and nice to people. We're giving her that foundation at home, but she's also getting that foundation here. And that foundation started in the preschool level. Having seen the students that come up from preschool, um, it is different, you know, not only academically, but even spiritually and socially being able to interact with the students better. It's amazing how that Christ influence impacts us even at a young age as preschool. It prepares us for the world because I know that this school, you know, you may have problems at the school, but everyone's here to help you out and they're here to show you, okay, when you go out into the world, this is what you gotta do. And then you come home and you can share that knowledge that you just got with your other family members so that everyone benefits. So it's like a win-win, win-win-win-win-win sort of situation. I like how we're digging into God's Word. Help me like grow spiritually too and like help me learn how to be like better friend and like Christian and how to like socialize more and interact with other people better. I have learned that as a Christian, you can change. Because watching students come in as one type of person and leave a better person, and it's because of Christ, it, it like just solidifies everything that we're doing. But we know that at least five days a week, she's getting a, a biblical experience, you know, that's just not reserved for, for Sunday school. I don't like going to public schools at all because they don't want to teach about the Bible. That's why I want to be at a Christian school to learn about God. The school comes alongside what we are trying to do at home and expands on it during the day. Well, it's like hard to find a school that's like all like bringing God into everything and like helping people through stuff and tough times, prayer and all the learning that goes on. You feel like there are people behind you, in front of you, and to your side. 
to help you and to help you grow with your walk with Jesus. When you educate someone, you know, um, they can do, you know, just about anything. But, you know, the other thing that we feel is when you educate someone with Christianity and the ways of the Lord, there's nothing they can't do.